Priestess of Suzaku had finally returned to her home. But even though she was back in the modern world, she could not find her friend Yui. Lady Miyaka came to realize that Yui must have somehow taken her place, falling into the book, into the universe of the four gods, and into the other world. Concerned for her best friend's safety, Lady Miyaka returned through the book to go after her. She learned that in the short time she had been gone, three months had passed in the world of the book, and Kuto was preparing to invade the Konan Empire. When the Emperor asked her to find the Suzaku Seven, Lady Miyaka and Nuriko set out to find Tamahome. What's the big idea? Tamahome? Miyaka. But before she knew what was happening, the Lady Miyaka was pulled away into the night. Miyaka! They disappeared. really hurt, you know. <sighs> Who is this person? What a healthy bite you have, Priestess of Suzaku. I should have asked you before I rescued you from the Kuto warriors, you know. Huh? Don't let them catch you off guard, Priestess. Huh? Oh? What? Huh? <sighs> he vanished without a trace. And I never even found out what his name was. Miyaka! Tamahome! Are you alright? Yes, I am, but I think someone is after me. Who are they? Why do they want me? What went on here, Noriko? We were ambushed from the trees with a hail of arrows. It was right after we lost sight of the two of you. <laughs> I could swear those arrows were meant for Miyaka. They were after me. The guy who grabbed me, he told me they were. You spoke to him? They were killed because someone was trying to get to me. Mm. I see shock has no effect on your appetite. The guy in the hat told me I was being stalked by Kuto warriors, and he was right. They know the priestess is the protector of this kingdom. They have a lot of reasons for wanting her dead. <laughs> hmm? Don't worry about a thing, Miyaka. I'll take good care of you. I'm not going to let you out of my sight again. Tamahome. We have trouble, Tamahome! 
Bandits are about to storm the West Gate. <laughs> it's money time. Mm -hmm. huh? Oh, <clears throat> yes, I forgot. I promised to keep Miyaka safe. Nuriko, you watch her. Bye. Mm -hmm. Woo! -hoo! Time to kick some bandit. Butt. Well, I guess he cares more about money than about me. <clears throat> Maybe we ought to do something about Tamahome's greed before we find the Suzaku warriors. I believe you have Tomahome all wrong. He may charge money, but his prices are very reasonable. <laughs> thirty intruders defeated? Pays thirty. Not much money for someone who just saved the village. That's barely enough for ten loaves of bread and a cup of coffee. Tomahome is a very good man. But a good man would defend the village because he cares about it, not because he wanted to be paid money for his services. Money? What harm is there in asking for a few cents? Is that all? Now who's being selfish? It really isn't much. Why pick on him so? I wonder why in the world he wants money so badly. Stop thinking about Tamahome. Why is he so obsessed with money? Huh? Whoa, easy there. What's he doing? I wonder where he's off to so early in the morning. Better find out! Noriko, come on! Come on! Wake up! Wake up! <laughs> I know! <laughs> Well, if it huh? isn't young Tomahome, how you doing? Oh, fine. I thought I'd drop in for a visit. Well, what do you know? This must be his home village. You think so? Wow, the village where he grew up to become the boy I know. <laughs> you are hopeless. Miyaka. Have you all been good? Yeah, 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 we've all been good. <laughs> I've never seen Tamahome looking so happy. Dad, I'm home. A side of him I never knew. Tamahome. You're looking better every day, Dad. And, <laughs> look at this. I brought home some money to help out. Thank you. That means a lot. Chue's been taking care of things while you've been gone. Chue, well done. Well, I'm not doing too bad, huh? but the crops aren't looking good. Don't worry. Just keep that money and make sure to spend it wisely. Thank you, son. I'm glad you find the time and the room in your heart to care about us. But it's time for you to begin building a life of your own. You should be married, son. Maybe. But in the meantime, I'm fine. Well, listen, I've got to go. Chue, you make sure to take care of everybody, all right? Can't you stay for supper? Stay with us, big brother, please. Not this time, but I will bring you a new doll next time I visit. No! All I want is you! <laughs> Yuiren, listen. I need all you kids to stay strong. You know everything I do is for you guys. I have to go away and do what I do and get money for us. Just try to be patient. Money is scarce. All I can charge anyone is just enough for us. Well, I prefer money, Daddy. Thank you. Huh? The price is one silver we owe each. Then that... that was for his family. <laughs> What's wrong? What? What is it? Uh, 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 uh. She has a fever. She doesn't look good. What are you waiting for? Let's put this girl in bed and bring me a damp cloth. Right. 
She needs to sweat off this fever. Bring more blankets, lots of them. Okay. All right. She needs to take this medicine. Get her some water to wash it down with. Right. It looks like the medicine is starting to work. Now then. <laughs> Do you want to tell me why you followed me here, Miyaka? I should disappear now. That Please. won't make you invisible. Hey. Huh? Brother, who is this person? Is she your wife? What? This girl? You gotta be crazy, Yokoda! I'm just a school kid! I'm not ready to be married Don't yet! listen to them. They might act embarrassed, but they've gotten very close. I'm sure they've gone all the way by now. Mm -hmm. oh. Don't make jokes with such a straight face or he'll believe you, idiot! Tamahome... He's blushing. Hi, big brother. She's getting better. Why don't you keep her company? I'll go get her some more water. Miyaka. Huh? Thank you for everything. <gasps> so, the priestess of Susaku walks alone. We have her at last. I'm not even his girlfriend and I'm fantasizing about being his wife. Tamomi will never think of me that way. And besides, he's only a character in a book. In this, the universe of the four gods, Suzaku's book, Hotohori got it directly from Taitsukun, the creator. There are hints in this book that will help me find the Suzaku Seven. And maybe... I haven't got time to sit here and daydream about Tamahome. I have to gather the last four of the Suzaku Seven and find Yui, fast! Monk. That's the first word. And... mask, I think. Hmm? Well, well. The priestess of Suzaku. As she sat by the riverbank, a man approached her. Within seconds, the priestess of Suzaku found herself fighting for her life. Fighting for her life? <gasps> Something's wrong with Miyaka. Tamahome? Tamahome, wait! <laughs> <laughs> Watch where you're swinging that thing! The guy who seemed to know so much about these people who want the priestess of Suzaku dead. Hmm. Well, who are you? You don't look like a regular person. Hey, you don't have to be mean, you know. I'm just your basic wanderer, you know. I warned you about those men, you know. You should have sensed the enemy's presence. Very careless, you know. What's your excuse, Tamahome? Uh, well, thank you very much for the warnings and for helping us fight the assassins. The time for giving thanks is not now, but later, you know. And if you want to stay alive, I'll give you some advice, you know. For one thing, Priestess of Suzaku, you've got to start taking responsibility for your own actions, you know. Responsibility? If you don't, innocent people will suffer on your account. Come
cowardly Kudo assassin. He wouldn't dare. You see, this is what happens, you know. Innocent people will suffer on my account? Oh, no. No, because of me, Tamahomi's family could be in danger. Don't be foolish! If you want your friends to live, you will let me kill you without resistance. Now, step forward. He would kill these little children and a sick old man. No, don't give in to him, Yaka. Disappear, why not give us some information? Just for starters, how many more ruthless cowards has Kuto sent to Conan to kill Miyaka? Uh, talk! Uh, Look out! Uh, 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 <laughs> you did it! You sensed the enemy's presence this time, Tamahome. You are better than I thought you know. Oh, I'm not that good. Hey, one of you guys could have at least protected me, too! <laughs> huh? We'll have the last laugh. Your kingdom will crumble. Once we found the priestess, the priestess of Sedu. The priestess of Sedu? What's that supposed to mean? Who's the priestess of Sedu? Huh? So you're one of the Suzaku Seven too, huh? <laughs> oh yeah, my name is Chichiri, you know. I'm not a Mr. Fox face, you know. Yeah, but does the skin of your face always peel off like that? It looks like it hurts you. My face is fine! Huh? I always keep a spare, you know. <laughs> Good work, Miyaka. You found the fourth of the Suzaku Seven. Thanks. Though personally, I think he's a little weird. Okay, I'll be weird and you be gay, you know. I guess I should be happy. Huh? Oh, big brother. It's all right, Kyokuran. Chichiri says he doesn't sense any more enemies in our village. Tamahome? Huh? Sorry for all the trouble. I know this is all my fault. Please don't feel that way. We are honored that the priestess of Suzaku would see fit to visit our humble little dwelling. But I was the one that... He said not to worry, so don't. You did nothing wrong. So there's a legend about the Seven Stars in the Kuto Empire as well? I heard it while I was traveling their borders, you know. Ever since the people of Kuto heard that the Priestess of Suzaku had appeared in Konan, they've been searching for the Priestess of Seryu. So you're saying that the same way Miyaka is trying to gain the power of Suzaku to make her wishes come true, the Priestess of Seryu would probably be seeking the power of Seryu for the same reason? Mm-hmm. It makes a lot of sense when you think about it. After all, the old witch, or whatever you call her, Tightskoon, gave each of the four kingdoms their own unique copy of the universe of the four gods. But to find a priestess with the right stuff, they'd have to be lucky enough to find a different girl from another world. And... <gasps> Yui! If Yui did end up coming to this world, then she could be found by the Kuto Empire. And they could make her into the priestess of Seryu. That would make us enemies in this world. Miyaka, is something wrong? You're not speaking. You're as white as a ghost. Oh, don't you worry about me. I'm... I'm fine. 
I just remembered something I have to do, so I'd better be running off. Miyaka! If you don't, innocent people will suffer on your account. Now I know I have to go to Kuto. There's no choice. I have to find Yui. No matter what else happens, I'm not going to put any more innocent people in danger. Nobody else is going to die because of me. That's why I've got to go to Kuto, and I've got to go alone. And so, unprotected and alone, the priestess of Suzaku ventured out for the land of Kuto. Jeopardizing the lives of Tamahome and the others, the Lady Miyaka travels by herself into the enemy nation of Kuto. There, she is overjoyed to be reunited with her friend, the Lady Yui, but finds that heaven has already decreed they each bear a heavy burden. Next time, looking for Yui for the sake of an irreplaceable friend.